All right, you guys. Here is the CEO of the pillow industry. His name is Khan Baba, also known as the walking balloon. His body is built like cotton candy and he looks a little bit like the Pringles guy. He needs to stay away from sharp objects or he will deflate. When he rips his shirt and gets angry, it's time to feed him again. This woman is wrestling with his finger. The girl and his blood sugar have something in common. Both refuse to go down on him. Okay, now you are our guest, so... <laughs> Khan Baba is a natural vegan and the strongest man in the world. The strongest man in the world. Khan Baba. This is a dream come true. This was my big dream to be the strongest man in the world. Much respect to Khan Baba for winning the trophy. But there is one man that nobody talks about who deserves even more respect. And it's the guy who designed and built his toilet seat. His trophy was sent by the vegan CrossFit champion Eddie Hall. So obviously Khan Baba. Just, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna get the trophy now and just post it to Khan Baba. Come on. Right. Here we go. Bye bye trophy. <laughs> Commercial airlines hate this guy because he claims three seats and only pays for one. And he is also hated by mosquitoes because he is always covered in many thick layers. Khan Baba is a comedian and he is a funny guy but he is the reason why there is a food shortage in Pakistan right now. He is what you call a DILF. Diabetic I like to forget. His blood type is high fructose corn syrup. When Khan Baba became the world's strongest man, Eddie Hall accepted his loss and stopped trying. He then transitioned into a woman and now he's dominating women's sports. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Your breakfast is here. Khan Baba may be stronger than Eddie Hall right now, but who of them is the funniest? Anyway you guys, always remember, at the end of the day it's night and every little thing is gonna be alright. If it's not alright, it's not the end. What the time what? Time go or something. Time It's a bit, it's a bit judgmental isn't it? <laughs> Funny thing is the staff came for Calazar and they just, just didn't know what to say. Yeah, it's like, it must have been another call, they're like, yeah we'll go tell them. <laughs> <laughs>